In this video, I will tell you what kind of flour to use for pizza. Spoiler alert, is not zero zero. Hello everybody, welcome to Fabulous Pizza. If you're watching this video, you have read 2,400 recipes and each of them suggests using different flowers, so you're looking for some clarity. Let's see if I can help you here. Now, we know there are many different kinds of flour. Actually, there is a whole world to discover when we talk about flour. But I will take it easy and focus on two main categories. This is plain flour, often called all-purpose. This is bread flour, often called strong flour. Besides the commercial name, they look the same, same color, same texture. The smell is more or less the same. The difference must be somewhere else then. The main difference we need to consider is the protein content. You will see it somewhere on the package of the flour, on the nutritional information. Usually plain flour contains less proteins than bread flour. Why is this of any interest for us? Because the higher the protein content, the more thirsty our flour will be. It means that to get a certain texture of your dough, you will need a lower amount of flour if it contains more proteins and you will need more flour if it's less rich in proteins. To make this clear, have a look at my dough calculator on the description of the video. Try choosing different kinds of flour and then uh, you will notice the uh, different doses you will get. Uh, also, uh, different proteins content means different resistance of your dough to a long rising time. The more proteins you have, the longer rising time you can afford. Finally, what about this zero zero flower the experts talk about? Is this the magic touch you need to get perfect pizza? Short answer is no. Long as well, zero zero is just a name. It doesn't tell us anything. It doesn't tell us if the flour is good to make pizza. In Italy, we have a classification that goes like this. There is the whole meal, we say integrale. There is the number two, number one, the zero and the double zero. The sequence is from lower to high level of uh, refinement. So while integrale contains part of the seeds, like the, the bran, the zero zero is heavily filtered and it contains just the core of the seed. So to answer our initial question, what flour to use? Use any flour, but be aware of the differences. Adjust your recipe accordingly to the kind of flour and adjust the rising time. Do your experiments and you will eventually get results like the ones you see on my Instagram feed. 